Praise that cannot communicate with you directly, O God. Praise that that comes with understanding. In the name of Jesus, we thank you. We adore you. In Jesus' name. Let us all shout Amen. Amen. Oh, let us shout Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Why don't you high five three people and tell them it's really good you are here. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you. Before we sit, let us read the scripture, the our theme scripture before we sit down. We will first read Psalm 100, and you remember what we did last week. So we're going to do it the same way that Sally will lead us. She will sit, read the verse in Japanese. And we will respond with verse 5, saying, For he, for the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth through all generations. Are, are we ready to praise the Lord? Amen. All right, let's do it together. For the Lord is good, His mercy is everlasting, and His truth endureth to all generations. For the Lord is good, His mercy is everlasting, and His truth endureth to all generations. For the Lord is good, His mercy is everlasting, and His truth endureth to all generations. For the Lord is good, His mercy is everlasting, and His truth endureth to all generations. Now let's say it with conviction, with joy. For the Lord is good, His mercy is everlasting, and His truth endureth to all generations. Let's clap our hands to Jesus. Now, Exodus chapter 15, verse 11. We are going to read it together, both in English and Japanese at the same time. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's read it together. Ready? Go. Who is like unto thee, O Lord, among the gods? Who is like thee, glorious in holiness, fearful in praises, doing wonders? Shino yo na kami ga hoka ni iru daro ka. Shino yo ni subarashiku, sey naru kata ga hoka ni iru daro ka. Kiseki o kona wareru shino yo ni tatae rare, osore rare ru kami ga hoka ni iru de aro ka. Wonderful. So before you say that one more time, high five the person next to you and tell them, my God is fearful in praise. Glory to you. Indeed, our God is fearful in praise. Because there's no God like him. Is the God that said, Is anything too hard for me? Amen. So there's nothing that is impossible if only you can connect with God. For with God, nothing is impossible. I know faith puts us in the realm with God. But one of the ways that we can connect with God and have God operate, take seat in our life is through praise. But the Bible tells us in Psalm 22 that our verse 3 that our God is enthroned in the praises of his people. 
So whatever we do in praise, basically what we are doing is that we are connecting to the platform where we operate with God. And with God, nothing is impossible. Why don't you lift up your hands and praise Him one more time? It doesn't matter what, matter what they are going through. I will bless the Lord at all times. Hallelujah, glory to His name. Glory to His name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We thank you. You know, we are we. 私たちは祝福された人々です。なぜなら私たちの新たな契約においては、like、to to 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 神の臨在をこう感じるためにすごく難しかったその旧約聖書の時とは違って。But Paul tells us that we have a better covenant. That the covenant that we have now is that we have access to the presence t o the blood of Jesus Christ. That is why we can boldly say that we come into his presence. Enter through his gates with thanksgiving. You have to get the opportunity before you can enter through the gates. And last week I mentioned that it is because of the blood of Jesus Christ that we enter through the gate. The gate, Jesus said, I am the door. That is, why, that is why we need to thank Him. Then the first thing we must thank Him for is that thank you for the blood. It's because, it's because of your blood that I'm able to have access to your presence. So that is why we must allow the joy of salvation to flow through us. なので私たちは救いの喜びにあふれているべきです。Because when we understand what the Lord has done for us, even by the sacrifice of His blood, なぜなら神のイエスの血の犠牲によってすべて与えられたからです。Our mouth will continually be full of praise. 私は常に祝福をする。And we understood last week that the Bible commands us to praise the Lord with all of our hearts. 私たちはもう心から神を賛美するべきだというふうに聖書にはあります。The praise that, that brings wonders, that brings the present, activate the hand of God is the praise that comes from our hearts. 賛美というのは奇跡を起こす力があります。From the depths of our hearts. 私たちの心の内から、心からする賛美には力があります。It is the true praise that the, our Father desires because true praise requires that you Give it from your spirit, from the, your innermost being. And we talk about five key points about the heart of praise. Do we remember? And what, what is the first one that we talked about? <laughs> Hallelujah. Holy. We said the heart of praise is the heart that seeks, that pursues, that acknowledges, acknowledges the holiness of God. Thou art holy. You who inhabits the praises of Israel. Psalm 22, verse 3. Exodus 15, verse 11 says, You are holy. You are glorious in holiness. It's also the heart that pursues holiness. Because without holiness, no one can see God. And if God inhabits praise, praise brings you with God, then it means you must allow holiness to have its work in us. And the, our holiness, our righteousness is from the Lord. And what is the next one that we talked about? The heart of praise is the heart that is what? Expressive, yeah. 
and all that is within me. Blesses make a joyful, a joyful noise unto the Lord. And the next one is attentive. You have, must have the right attitude of worship. You must acknowledge that God is there, is around. Our minds and our everything must be focused on God in our praise. Hallelujah. The fourth one we talked about was Reverence. Hallelujah. We, we, we give him our, we understand that we surrender. He is the king of kings. He made us some hundred. Know that he made us, not we ourselves. And the last one is Lord is seeking those who will worship him in spirit and in truth. True praise is real. It's not, it's not trying to imitate, trying to please other people. The woman at the well was sincere in her communication with, with Jesus Christ. She was not trying to hide anything. Yes, this is who I am. The real priest acknowledges that we need God, we need Jesus to work in our life. The, I am hungry for that water. Can you give me some that water so that I will never thirst again? True praise to understand who God is. Jesus told the woman, You do not know who you worship. Psalm 47, verse 7 tells us that we should praise the Lord with understanding. We don't just praise the, the Lord haphazardly. No, we praise Him with understanding, knowing that this is our communion with Him. I said all, all of this to get us to relax and get ready for the presentation. Amen. So today we're going to do two quick things. We're going to open the floor for the groups to present what they discussed. We have had only the hospitality group to present. Hospitality group no kata. Holy, yeah, they present here. Ah, no, yeah, last week. So are we ready today? We are ready. We are excited. So we will call Harvest one to go first. Let's clap our hands to Jesus as Harvest comes. We are still the heart of praise. Let's clap our hands as Sister Yurika comes. Uh, last Sunday we talked about attentive or attitude of a Christian. Christian um, um, in Psalm 100 verse 2, it is our attitude to always have gladness in our heart. Amen. Amen. In Psalm 103 verse 1 I know every one of us has an understanding that everything we have is from God so we praise him in every situation not only in good times but also in bad times Hallelujah. in Psalm 96 verse 9 it is also our attitude to to be holy not just inside but also in our outside appearance like how we dress. Amen. 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 
何を着るかというのも私たちが私たちのクリスチャンとしての態度には必要です。In Psalm 34, verse 5, people around us will see by our attitude in our face how grateful we are, how good it is being Christian. 詩篇の34ペンの方あの参考にしたんですけれども、私たちがどういった態度であるかというのは、私たち、他の人々が私たちをクリスチャンとしてどう見るかというのに関わってきます。For all the goodness and faithfulness of God, for all He had done for us, He is our Creator, He gave us His Word, He laid down His life for us, He filled us with the Holy Spirit, who He is in our life not to praise. In everything we do every day, we praise. praising Him is the best thing to do. 神は私たちを想像された方で私たちに聖霊を与えられて私たちに全てを与えられた方なので私たちは神を賛美する必要があります。ハレルヤ。God bless you. Let's clap our hands to Jesus. どうぞイエスに拍手をしましょう。Praise is communication. And everything that we do in praise in our lives communicate with God. We are a living testimony, a living sign. We said we are chosen to show forth the praises of Him who has called us out of darkness. into His marvelous light. So, our attitude speaks a lot concerning our relationship, our, the praise that we are giving to our God, how we represent our God. So, everything, everything about us. Because if our heart is clean, it must show on the outside. Remember, we said praise is a lifestyle. Amen. We would like to welcome the next group. Who wants to go? It's national ready. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We will、we'll、welcome Brother Justice. Let's clap our hands to Jesus. Praise God. Amen.、Uh, we had a very intensive discussion last week about reverence of God. And we started by the definition to understand what reverence means. And we gave some、uh, definitions like to honor. そして偉大な愛と尊敬また尊敬のジェスチャー。Go forward. Now we have a lot of, we had a lot of points, and、um, we, we realized that we have to, whatever we do, we have to do it in reverence to God. Our Attitude to God must be of the highest、uh, reverence to God. And we have to, to love God, to trust God, to praise God, and we have to do all this in reverence. And our praise should come from within, from our heart. And we also realize that、um, 
we have to give reverence to God for what he has done for us, what he's doing for us, and what he will be doing for us. Now, um, before we can have, before someone can have reverence or respect to someone, uh, he or she must know that person. You can give a, a respect or reverence to maybe someone you do not know, someone you heard of, but it will not live long. It will be short-lived. So for this reason, before we can have a perfect reverence to God, we have to know him. そして、ですので私たちが完全な尊敬を持つためには私たちは個人的な神との関係を持つ必要がありますそして私たちは本当に真の密接した関係を持つ必要があります私たちは一対一の関係を持つ必要があります we do this by studying the word. そしてこれらのことというのは私たちが聖書を学ぶことによってできます um, Ephesians 5:21 says submit to one, uh, one another out of the reverence for Christ. エペソビトの手紙5章21節にキリストに対する恐れの心を持って互いに使い合うべきであるとあります So we now realize that reverence for God also is very important in our day-to-day life. Without reference to God, it will be very difficult to submit to each other, to a brother or a sister or anybody. Now, um, to be able to know God, to know him intimately, to have a, a personal relationship with him, in order to accomplish this, we really have to, we really have to study the word, not just by reading it as a history book, we have to study it and let God speak to us. Hallelujah. Not just to hear the word of God, but to hear the word, to hear from God. In Galatians 5:22 to 23, uh, we were introduced, we are introduced to the fruits of the of the Holy Spirit. Then that is love, joy, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. These fruits of the Spirit are the characteristics of, of, of Jesus. Characteristics or the nature of the nature of God. <laughs> this this, this fruit of the Holy Spirit is the nature of God. Amen. And now, if we have a personal relationship with God, intimate relationship with God, this fruit of the Spirit will become the byproduct of having personal intimate relationship with God. Amen. This fruit of the spirit will be born out of the relationship with God. Amen. Amen. And if we have this personal relationship with God and we have this born out of our relationship with God, it will also come out of our attitude when we are outside on the street in the restaurant or even in the church here. And uh, in Acts 4:13 it says when the people 
saw uh, Peter and John, when they saw they are, I mean, boldness in how they preach, although they were ignorant and not learned, they realized that they were with Jesus. 使徒行伝の4章13節でペテロとヨハネが大胆に神のことを語っていたときに周りの人々はペテロとヨハネはとてもあの教養のある人々ではなかったのですが彼らの語り方によってイエスと共にいた人々だということを理解していました。So, so likewise, if we have this intimate personal relationship with God and this affects our attitude when we are outside When we are in the grocery store, in the trains, when they see us, they will say, No, I realize this sister, this brother, in TWT. When we are in the grocery store, この兄弟姉妹は、ダチモア兄弟、ナツ兄弟と一緒に過ごしていたと。そして、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、神の尊敬の念を持ち、私たちがそれにあって動くのであれば、人々は神の素晴らしさに引き込まれます。どうぞ、イエスに拍手をしてください。グローバルの方、どうぞ。A heart of、uh, praise to express it. Amen. Sambi no Kokoro to in a Hyogen ni Tonde Imasu. Bible says, Let everything that has bread praise the Lord. It says in Psalm 100, verse 6. Amen. Iki no Arimono was Shu Hometata Yoto Arimasu. Saints, we, are a full, we give our,、uh, the Lord full of expression. If we know the Lord that we are serving is alive and He is worthy to be praised, Amen. We are God's creation, right? Amen. So God says that we have to worship the Lord with all our heart, with all our soul, with all our mind, and with all our strength. Amen. And we can give that worship to the full of expression first. We cannot talk about shouting. The Bible says in Psalm 100, verse 1: Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands, serve the Lord with gladness, come before his presence with singing. Amen. We are praising God because he is worthy to receive glory. Amen. For great is the Lord and most worthy of praise. Is all, he is to be feared above all gods in Psalm 96, verse 4. Second expression, saints, is about speaking. Amen. It says that. In speaking, God is useful and favorable for us. By praising God, we are reminded of the greatness of God, His power and presence in our life is reinforced in our understanding. Amen.、Oh. Amen. Okay. Amen. Okay. 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 So we are praising God for speaking because it's useful and favorable for us. By praising God, we are reminded of the greatness of God, His power and presence in our lives is reinforced in our understanding. Amen. We, we praise God through the expression of singing. 
Amen. In Psalm 135 verse 3, it says, Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing praise to His name, for that is pleasant. Amen. Hallelujah. We praise God for uh, because of the expression of playing for the instrument. In playing the instrument, it transforms the spiritual environment that we have. Amen. It says in Psalm 150 verse 35, Praise Him upon the loud cymbals. Praise Him upon the high sounding cymbals. Hallelujah. Like the Bible says in 2 Chronicles 5 verse 13 and 14, it clearly illustrates that the alteration that happened when the Levites gave praise and thank to the Lord and the temple was filled with a cloud signifying the glory of God. Hallelujah. The trumpeters, the singers joined in unison as with one voice to give praise to the, to the Lord and accompanied by the trumpets and cymbals. Other instruments they raised their voices in praises to the Lord. He is good. His love endures forever. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And the next one is about our posture. It's very important for us also in worshiping the Lord with our posture. One is bowing. Amen. Hallelujah. When we when we sang and praised it to the Lord, when we said it we we have to bow down, we have to do it. Amen. Hallelujah. To respect the reverence of God. Hallelujah. We are worshiping also the Lord with its standing. Amen. And dancing with the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God inhabits the atmosphere of praise. In Psalm 22, verse 3, But thou art holy, O thou God, that inhabitest the praise of Israel. If we want to see a clear manifestation of God's blessings and grace, all we need to do is to praise Him with all our heart, with all our mind, and with all our soul. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. David say, said that we use the expression because he wanted to worship God with our entire being. His heart was to worship the Lord with everything he had and we held nothing back in worship. He wanted to share with us his heart and desire to worship. Remember saints that Worship is not about you and it's not about imitating your neighbor. It's about letting the Lord lead you to worship Him in a manner that He desires and that we need. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I just want to encourage everyone. Let us always seek the grow in our worship to the Lord. May we ever allow His Spirit to move in us as He directs our action and responses in worship. It's all about our God. Him for Him. What we, re what we receive is a heart of humility, grace, and reverence before God who saved us from sin to be His children forever. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Let's clap our hands to Jesus. Now we have gotten the opportunity to hear different aspects about the heart of praise. The Bible says that God is seeking true worshipers. We've talked about true worship is really a lifestyle. 
真の賛美というのはライフスタイルです。If we can put back the scripture, Romans chapter 12, verse, verse 1 in the amplified version that we have. As we turn the, we thank the Lord for all the comment that has come. We could see that the emphasis is that our relationship with God shows in our praise. And it also shows in our daily lifestyle. You know, there's a reason that we have the cross. 私たちに十字架が与えられるというのは理由があります。And that is also the two pillars of this church that we worship our God. 私たちは私たちの神を賛美し。And we also show that worship in the way we fellowship with one another. そして私たちがお互いと交わるときにそれも現れます。Both the vertical and the horizontal. そして私たちはこの十字の形においてそれはなされます。That is the cross. それが十字架です。We cannot say we love God. And hate our neighbor. If we say we revere, we respect God in our worship. It must show in the way we treat the people around us. そうであるなら私たちが他の人々をどう,とどういったふうに接しているのかというのも見られます。私たちが聖なる神を褒め。That holy God who is at work in us must show in our lifestyle to others. If we say we have the right attitude, we are attentive praise and worshippers. It must show in our attitude towards our relationship with one another. You can, when you say you are very expressive in your praise, you give your all to God in your praise. It must show in everything that you do. You do not do things haphazardly. Your praise is really the expression of your character, the, the, the spirit. That is inside of you. Oh, you like David. David was a wonderful praise and, and worshiper. But he was a person too that did everything with excellence. The little thing that you give, you give David, taking care of the sheep, he would do it with excellence. To the extent that he would even risk his life to try and get the little the lamb out of the mouth of the bear, bear or, the ty- or the lion. You see, everything that you give to God, your true worship must, it shows in your character. Because our God knows everything. So if you say you are shy, what you are trying to say is that you don't understand that it is Him who has made you. Our daily sacrifice, our daily lifestyle is our worship to God to us. Romans chapter 12, verse 1. It, Please, if you can have it on the screen, uh, amplify. Who, who has the amplified version? Amplified on you, Leviticus. Amplified on you, Leviticus. Amplified on you, Leviticus. Amplified on you, Leviticus. Amplified on you, you, Leviticus. By the mercies of God, to present your bodies, dedicating all of yourselves, set apart as a living sacrifice, holy and well pleasing to God, which is your rational, logical, intelligent act of worship. Wonderful. 
our daily lifestyle. Everything that we do is the expression of our worship. For the past two weeks, we have talked about worship and praise. But because of time, next week, what we are going to do is that now we are going to show, we are going to really do the act of worship and praise here. Oh, you are not excited. So what we are going to do is that Psalm 47 verse 7 says we should praise the Lord with understanding. And we have gotten the heart of praise now. So we are going to now praise the Lord with understanding. And when we say praise, there are some seven Hebrew words that, me, that, that represent praise. There are more, more words, but the seven is very common that we all know. And so what we are going to do next week is that each group will take one. And use that as, as, as a point of understanding to lead us in praise. Don't worry, that's why I'm going to give you what you are going to use now. So you have a whole week to think about it. And when we meet next week, you have time as a group to prepare yourself so that you can lead us in the praise during the lesson time. Are we excited about that? There's one thing to talk about it. There's another thing to do it. So the first word is halal. It's where we get that word hallelujah. Which means, which means to celebrate to, with a clear voice. The scriptures are there on the screen. I'm going to give all of this to the group leaders. But Hala will go to global. So we celebrate God in praise. So you have to think of how your group is going to do that and lead us in praise. I'll be working with the group leaders to give them detailed understanding of that so that when they come, they will teach us what it means and also lead us in that praise. Amen. If global is excited, let me hear them shout Amen. Oh, glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Next week is going to be awesome. The next, the next word that we will look at here is yada. It's not the Japanese yada. <laughs> do you know, do you, know, you see, ironically, this yada means like you are rejecting something you don't want to obey, right? But this one rather means to extend your hand in surrender. You know, to lift up your hands in worship. It's like a child saying, I, I, I cannot handle this. I'm fa- my, my mom, dad, take, pick me up. When it, it's wonderful because of the way and the nature it is. I think Yada will go to with national. Amen. So you are going to lead us with, in, in, in worship with Yada. Glory to Jesus. You see, the, the Bible says in Second Chronicles chapter 20, verse 21, Give thanks, Yada, to the Lord, for his loving kindness is everlasting. So, 
Second Chronicles. Verse So we lift up our hands saying that no, he owns everything. He, so he should pick us up, take charge. We worship him. National will take that and we will go to Toda. So she Toda. Not not Toda, Toda where we live. <laughs> yeah. So it, it is when you lift your hands in agreement. Every expression in praise means something. We may not understand it, but God understands. So, like when the message is going on and the word of God is going forth and it touches your spirit and you feel like raising your hands and saying, Hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. You are, you are toe dying to the Lord. You are agreeing to the word of God. You are lifting your hands in agreement. You are showing your expression. You are so excited. You adore what the, who the Lord is in your life. And you say that every Every word of his is true. So ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、ただ、
members of the worship team with you so you can consult them as well. Amen. Glory to Jesus. And we will leave Zama for the worship team. Which means to play with the instruments. You know, Zama is so wonderful. And so is the praise that if, when a king is coming, most of the time you hear people, you know, reciting some some things telling about his greatness and be playing instruments. It's so wonderful that an instrument shout, playing instruments really activate the presence of the Lord. Whenever the king is coming, remember the Lord will be coming at the shout of the trumpet. Playing, of, playing instruments is not just that we are trying to show off. Really, it is done with understanding. Very preparing the way because the king is coming. And hospitality and global will work together to heal the Lord. It's because basically it's Tehillah is connected to Halal, you are shouting his praise, but this one is more like is this is the one you are singing, is the praise that God really inhabits. Expressing his greatness. Adoration. One thing about Tehila is that it's most of the time is the worship that we do during worship break. We don't practice it. It comes. It flows from the spirit. So how to do this, the group leaders must talk among themselves. I will help you to also know how to lead us in Tehillah. You cannot really pre prepare for this. It shows for, you know, sometimes we are worshiping the Lord and then the worship leader will say, he's holy. Just we'll, be, just we'll be playing the melody and then spontaneous sound will be coming. Oh, you can take that opportunity and teach us a new song that we will all sing together and that will also lift up the name of the Lord. So, that is what we're going to do next week. Are we excited? That means you must come early. Because we're going to start on this on the on time so that we can have time for everyone to lead us in this praise that we, we want to show to our Lord. Our advice everyone to prepare, come with your, your handkerchiefs and everything ready to dance to praise the Lord next week. Amen. Do we, are we okay? Are we excited? Glory to Jesus. Let's turn up to our feet. Now, with the heart of praise, let's lift up our hands and glorify our God. Let's worship you the beauty of His holiness. Hallelujah. You can lift up your hands in worship and in praise. You can bow down in worship and worship in this few seconds. Tell him how good he is. Let us now therefore offer sacrifices of praise, which is the fruit of our lips. Let's Father, we thank you. We adore you. You are holy. You are wonderful. You are marvelous. We thank you. We give you praise. You are worthy of all the praise. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. Glory be to your name. Hallelujah to your name. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Father, we thank you for all that you have shared with us. We are saying that, Lord, you alone deserve all our praise. Our praise is unto you, not to ourselves. To you alone be all the glory.
We thank you, Jesus. We adore you, O oh God. Father, with the garment of praise, we open up our hearts to you, O oh God. We are asking the Lord Jesus, have your way. Have your way in our hearts. Have your way in our church. Have your way in our children. Have your way today in the name of Jesus. For you inhabit the praises of your people. Take charge, Holy Spirit. Father, we open the door for you, O God. We say, for thine is the, the glory. For thine is the kingdom. For thine is the power. And everything belongs to you, O God. To you alone be all the glory. We acknowledge that there is no God like you. There is no God like you. Open up your mouth, worship him. You alone deserve the praise. You alone deserve all the adoration. We thank you, Jesus. Glory be to your name. Why don't you clap your hands to Jesus? <laughs> Hallelujah. We, we're giving you five minutes to get ready for an awesome time of praise and worship. <laughs> you are blessed in Jesus' name. <laughs>